afternoon, everybody. I will not even say it's morning because it's not even close. I woke up early this morning and actually worked for about a half day. We got home yesterday at 12 a.m. So Cole is super tired and we just packed because literally in like an hour we're gonna drive to Salt Lake City for CVX Live. We are so excited about this. It is just going to be such a long trip, especially with an almost one year old who's never been on a road trip before and we just got back from a vacation, a week-long vacation, and it was basically go, go, go the whole time. I give Cole major props for dealing with all of this. I mean, he has been nothing but a trooper, and I know he'll do great on this trip, and he'll enjoy it because he loves meeting tons of new people and being in a busy, busy atmosphere. I just finished packing all the suitcases and I'm waiting for Chase to get home from a doctor's appointment. And I'm just so excited that I get this opportunity. Hi Cole. <laughs> Can you wave? Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Hi. Are you excited to go on another trip? Are you gonna be a good boy? Yes you are. You're such a good boy. You're such a trooper, huh? I think while I'm waiting for Chase to get home, I'm gonna plop right down here on this couch and watch The Bachelorette. I'm actually a couple of episodes behind because of our trip and not having the opportunity to actually sit down and watch. I can't believe I have this chance right now because <laughs> I thought today was gonna be super busy, but his appointment is taking a little longer than we thought, and so I'm just going to relax until he gets back. Excuse me, mister. Get off there. Get off there. Get off there. Come on. No. Well, thank you. Can mama have that, please? Thank you. It's already almost three o'clock and Chase is still not back. And I'm like, because we have such a long drive. It's going to take us probably over 10 hours to get there. <laughs> Did you hear mama talking and you came crawling like a little spider? Hi, can you wave? Hi, you're getting so good at waving. You're getting so good at waving. But yeah, we have like a 10 hour drive, if not more ahead of us. And so we wanted to kind of split it up into two days so that it wasn't so hard on Cole. So yeah, I'm yeah, thinking, yeah, 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 yeah. So I think that we'll end up probably driving maybe four hours today if we leave at about three. I think he's close to getting home. And we'll probably get to where we're gonna stay tonight, maybe around seven, eight, and then allow Cole to get a pretty good night's sleep. And then tomorrow, get up and do the rest of the drive. I think most of the drive is gonna happen tomorrow. Wow, really? Does my toe look tasty? Does my toe look tasty? Mama's toes are yucky. You don't want to bite those. They're yucky. Dada's home. Are you ready to go? Let's go on the road trip. Excuse this. <laughs> we just woke up. We ended up staying in Durango. Yeah, he was ready to be done. Cole was like, I do not want to drive any further tonight. Um, if you guys don't know where Durango is, it's in Colorado. So we are getting up right now. I'm not even going to shower so you get to look at this all day. And we're just going to drive the rest of the way to Salt Lake. They provide breakfast downstairs. We're going to go grab a little bite to eat first and then we're gonna be on our way. I'm so excited to finally get there. Cole loves being in new hotel rooms where he can explore every inch of it, huh? Ah. There you are. Look at that bed head. You have bed head like mama. You have bed head like mama. We're so fresh. Hi. 
I am seriously a hot mess right now. <laughs> I've been in the car for about six hours now. We just arrived in the Salt Lake. I'm getting so nervous, but so excited. We just finished getting ready and we are in the elevator headed to the convention. We're in a hotel that's really near to the Salt Palace, so we are going there right now. I asked the guy at the front desk, oh, where's the Salt Palace? And he was like, you are looking at it right there. <laughs> we didn't realize that our hotel was literally right across the street from it. So that's gonna make the weekend really easy. We are clearly in the wrong spot because there is nobody in here. <laughs> Just finished eating dinner. This is Faith from Life Forever Changed. Her channel is great. You guys should go check her out. We're heading back to CVX Live at the Salt Palace and it's a three day convention. So come say hi if you guys are here. I am back in my hotel room from the first evening at CVX Live. It was so much fun. It was so fun finally getting to meet Faith and Dwayne from Life Forever Changed. Like I said earlier in the vlog, what? Good night. So Good cool. night. You guys should definitely go check out their channel if you haven't already. They are great vloggers, totally nice people, great. very real and down to earth, so fun to hang out with. So definitely if you have not subscribed to them, you're missing out. You just want to be in the vlog. You love cameras. You love vlogging. So I'm going to try and start editing this vlog tonight because I really want to get it up for you guys on Friday, which is tomorrow, which is when I normally put my vlogs up. It's almost 9.30. You gotta get ready for bed. You're so hyper. So because of editing and wanting to get all that done, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog with the comment of the day from my last vlog. I will link my last vlog up here. The comment that I'm going to read is from Hannah A. And she said, I'm glad Cole is in good hands. If you hadn't seen Cole playing with the dice, he could have choked. Anyways, I'm happy that you got to visit your friends and family. I love you so much. And then she put tons of little hearts. Thank you so much, Hannah. I really appreciate your comment. And yes, I'm so glad I saw Cole playing with those dice. It was really a reminder that our house is baby proofed but like everyone else's houses obviously aren't which makes sense if you don't have a baby but I'm just so used to everything being safe for him to be around so that was definitely a wake-up call and yes we had a lot of fun visiting friends and family it was a great trip and I'm just happy to be blessed enough to be on this trip here and get to go to CVX like it's just been such a fun summer so far. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you liked it, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Say hello. I love reading everybody's comments. I think I'm going to leave you guys right here so I will see everybody in my next video and my next video will have a lot of CVX footage so that'll be lots of fun. Bye guys.